Oh, hey there. You're probably wondering what all this debris is. Well, all this debris comes from our oceans on the BC coast. I am at the Ocean Legacy Foundation headquarters where we are going to explore the entire field and find out what it's like to be a volunteer for the Ocean Legacy Foundation. So come on, let's go take a look. So my name is Chloe Dubois and I am the co-founder and executive director of the Ocean Legacy Foundation. And right now we're in a numerous partnerships. Um, our biggest partnership and sponsorship is with Lush Cosmetics North America. And we're also working now with the UK a little bit in um, creating a similar model to what we're doing here. Ocean Legacy is a nonprofit organization. Uh, we were founded in 2014 in a response to the drastic amount of plastic pollution that is currently choking our shorelines and our oceans. Um, we do spatial mapping, so you can visit our website and report GPS coordinates of plastic polluted hotspots in your community. You can share pictures and stories around that, and that helps us organize community members around removing those plastics and marine debris um, from those areas. We also do our own cleanup expeditions, we do research and education, and we also focus on alternative sustainable technologies in order to create solutions to process all of these materials. I think myself and a lot of people that volunteer for the organization, we do this because our eyes have been opened to the implications of plastic pollution in the marine environment. And I think once your eyes have been opened to those consequences, if we do nothing, um, those consequences are going to be quite drastic. And so that really kind of fuels us to keep going. And, you know, we, we feel that our efforts do make a difference, even though they might be considered small in retrospect of actually the, the complications of what's going on in the world. But every small action does make a difference. The 14-day Upcycle Challenge is a really exciting event where people can come with their families, uh, we get a lot of kids coming and it creates a bridge around people's awareness around the items that they, that they use like toothbrushes or tampon applicators, how those items end up back in the ocean and they get to learn about the implications of that. And you can also visit our website at uh, www.oceanlegacy.ca. Um, you can, there you can report GPS coordinates of plastic pollution in your community um, and then that way we can uh, really talk with you one on one about how we can clean up plastic in your community and, and how we can get the training and different education books um, as a resource guide for you. If you'd like to get involved with the Ocean Legacy Foundation, you're welcome to come down to our warehouse at 8601 Main Street. Um, although today is the last day of our 14 day upcycle challenge, um, we will be extending our hours just because more volume is actually coming in even after the challenge is over. So um, we are looking at opening uh, the warehouse full time and having um, materials kind of trickle in throughout the entire season. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, and comment below and tell us what you're going to do to keep the oceans debris free. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at Pitching Canada, and we'll see you next week for a new video.